Hey coach, so happy you found us um, at, uh, at on YouTube. It's great, there's lots of great resources out there. Go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who wanna get better, you wanna win more games, less time from someone that's done it. Let me mentor you, let me help you. Teachhoops.com will allow you to do that, that's the first thing. Also go over and subscribe and like. If you do like uh, the podcast, it's a great place to kinda find all the resources and things that you need to become a better basketball coach. So. Um, have a great day and go enjoy the video. Go. All right, first one up, we're gonna do our um, our throw and catch tennis ball series. So there's three levels of this. The first one is just with a one crossover move. The second one is with a double move. And the third level is with three moves. Okay. So essentially what it is, we'll go level one first to start off. You get your dribble going, find your rhythm, throw the ball up, and catch it. Okay, you can do this with any of the crossover moves, the cross, the between the leg, or the behind the back. And it's good, Drew, because you're keeping your head up. Because you got to keep your head up to you catch sure the you ball. Find it. Okay, again, the higher you throw it, the easier it is. The lower you toss it, the harder it becomes. And then that last level that you can get to is when, when you're here, you hold it out, you drop it, you try to catch it that way. Okay? So, so you drop it before it hits the ground? You drop it and try to catch it before it hits the ground. So that means you got to be here, you got to get low, and try to catch as it's dropping down. So that's probably the hardest one. So even at level okay. one, it can get pretty tricky. All right, so level one, right, it's just simple, one move. In and out, cross, or between the legs. Remember, as we do with the other ones, our feet aren't gonna move on the crossover, right? So if I'm going here, I'm going between my legs, my feet don't move, okay? Same as all the other stuff. Now, for level two, same thing, but we're doing a double move. So if I throw it up, one, two, and I try to cross it, okay? So, right? Remember, the higher up you throw it, the easier it is, okay? Level two is that, and then level three, the hardest one obviously is where you go three moves. So if you cross, 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 cross between the leg, cross, whatever it is that you want to do, all right? Um, I'm not warm, so I'm not gonna try to demo that, but. <laughs> but it's also teaching you to have to do it faster, too. You're having to, yeah. Right, those double moves that I really perfected, so like that, uh, that Tim Hardaway, um, the old school Tim Hardaway, the between the legs crossover, that's how I got quick on that move, because I was trying to do it over and over again and be able to catch a tennis ball at level two, and that's how I worked on that. Okay. So why don't you give a couple tries, stay low, get your jump. And do you always start out with a tennis ball? Yeah, I usually start with a tennis, tennis ball. Tennis ball, okay. Yeah. See, it's forcing you to keep your head up, that's good. And then there, what, you, what you can do is you can adjust it too. If you're doing a double or triple move, maybe throw a little higher until you get better at it, and then you throw it lower. So you can really kind of adjust it to your level where you currently are. You know, you, you really kind of make it your own. Hey coach, so happy you enjoyed the video. Make sure you subscribe and like. Go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better.